Hello and welcome to Food Fellas. The show about food. Eaten by fellas. That's us too. Now today we are wrapping up our little mini-series, if you want to call it that, on the tastes of America. In chip form. Exactly. Uh, now this is our final episode. You may have seen our first two. I hope you've seen our first two, because otherwise this episode, well, yeah, that sort of makes sense, right? Yeah. Okay, good. So, uh, these are a bunch of regional chips from all across America. It, it was a bunch of regional chips. Well, it was. Um, over, there, were, there were originally 12, and over the last two episodes, we've done four each episode. Therefore, we are down to four, so it's literally already picked for us, but right. we're still going to do our thing, because it's fun. <laughs> um, Would you like to choose first? <laughs> sure. Here, hold the box. All right, and and you should know how this goes, but if there's somebody who's uninformed, we're just gonna rummage through this. Of course, there's only four, so not really any rummage. I'm just gonna pull one. Yeah, there we go. Ah, pimento cheese. Pimento cheese. Our first one. Of, one. one of my favorite things. Yeah. I don't eat it very much at all. I don't even know yeah. what it is. No, it's really good. Cheese and pimento. It's, but. I don't know if it's right. really unhealthy for you. Or I don't know. I can't think of it. I can't get the good for you. I have. Ooh. Cajun spice. That sounds, you, you know, I, I bet I know what they put on the chips. Mm. Cajun spice. All right. Whoop. Oh, 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 this is the one I've been excited about when we, until we first started. I'll explain this later, but ketchup chips. Ketchup flavored chips. Our final chip is dun, 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 dun. Fried pickles everywhere. That's one of my favorite things. Yeah. I okay. All, right. All right. And that's it. The box is the box is completely empty, as you can see. Nothing else in there. Oh, also, if I haven't mentioned this already, this is the season finale of Food Fun. Mm -hmm. So enjoy this episode because you're not gonna have some for a couple more weeks. Right. All right. Maybe even a month. Maybe even a couple of months. Could be a couple of months. We are uh, taking this break to scout out different things for Food Fellows and to work on different projects. We are going to be on Hippopotamus. Hiatus. 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 We're going to be entering hibernation. Right. right. They would not allow us to get on the Hippopotamus. So no. now it said hiatus. Right. Right. Let's see how... It's... Yeah. I was going to try to do an alliteration, but I couldn't figure it out. All right. All right. All right. Now... What are we beginning with? Uh, let's begin with Cajun Spice. Cajun Spice. Cajun Spice. All right. These are kind of beat up. I'm not sure if, like... Well, they were at the bottom. They were at the bottom. So, I mean, yeah. we've been rubbing through this all day. All right, Cajun Spice. Uh, there's a nice purple bag. Uh, I'm going to read what the region is here. The Gulf Coast. Mmm. Florida. Cajun country. <laughs> Cajun country. I'm not going to do an accent because that may be offensive. Mm. Would like to guess what the spice is. Cajun Spice. Right. Bingo. All right. All right. Let's just do that. Right? Yeah. I guess I'm going to open the bag. I need to open the bag. Okay. All right. As always, smell test. Give it a little smell. That's a nice little smell. Ah. In that nice little smell, but. Mm. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> no way I'm doing that for us. All right. <laughs> trying to find the larger chip for you here. Here, take confetti. Right. <laughs> I'm going to take one. No time like now. Mm. Oh. Um. My palate is confused. Right. Um. Are you getting what I'm getting? I'm getting. <coughs> Like, I'm not sure if it's supposed to be like chili or <laughs> what it's supposed to be. At first, it almost seems sweet, right? And now it burns. But isn't that Cajun? <laughs> right. Isn't that Cajun spice? I'll have another one just for the heck of it. Here, the, the one, the half in your mouth. No, no, <laughs> the larger one. Oh, right. well, these are decent. Kind of going back to the first part of this, you know, where it kind of tastes, it tastes almost the same as the other ones. Right. Beginning. And to reference previous shows, mm -hmm. 
Cajun spice still better to me than lobster roll or crab spice. Mm. Yes, all the seafood ones have not been very good. I don't think I'm ever going to eat crab spice. Again. No? No. Alright. It's, it's still up there. I'll eat it at some point. Right. <laughs> I think I had some at some point. I'm sure. Oh. That's what I'm really excited about, too. The Punta cheese. Also, they got the bag color right. I mean, I'm a very aesthetically minded person, so I love this. The bag color. Oh, this isn't like a little design. I'm not going to do it. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna read this entire thing. This is great. This is southern. Very southern. Mm. I'm gonna read this in southern accent. Inspired by Sunday socials and southern charm, here's a taste of cream of sharp cheddar and pimento pepper. Y'all so welcome. <laughs> y'all so welcome. <laughs> Ooh, you, would y'all like to guess what the seasoning is? Tell me there's pimento cheese spice. It's there. pimento cheese spice. It's cheese. Stop doing that voice now that my pants are yeah. I'm not sure. It's much too late. Yep. Oh, look at that. It's a chip. They're very large chips. Here we go. All right. Whew. Disappointed in you, Mento cheese. I'm disappointed in you. Mm. So quickly. It's going again. Hmm. No, not quite there. Just not sure. It's like it tastes too much like a normal like cheddar sour cream it, chip. Exactly. It's not you know? a bad. It's not a bad chip. No, it's a really good chip. It's just not pimento cheese. No, they did not. They didn't so this is a cheese. good chip, just not what it intended to be. So looking forward to this one. All right, we're gonna do ketchup next because I want to save the fried pickles for last, but I think that's gonna be the best. Okay. All right. Um, you want me to do my bit with this here, cause, uh, cause my little thing, cause it's. I learned about these before we even knew about this. Ah. Because these are Canadian, or okay. they're at least widely served in Canada, as I understand. Right. But there's some sort of thing in Canada. Obviously, we live in the United States, so you know. I mean, we could live in Canada. Never nice. But they're originally they British, uh, too. So, obviously, you know, Canada is a little bit more influenced by uh, British culture right. than American. Um, but I've been excited about these because I kind of wanted to try some ketchup flavored chips because supposedly they're horrible. Hold on, you should look at the ingredients. Oh, I should. Sure you were so excited you were going to break tradition. Yes. Um, this does not have a region. Oh. Um, it's everywhere. It's everywhere. It's apparently everywhere. It literally, inspired by the flavor that makes everything better, it's no surprise that ketchup is found everywhere from backyard to small folks. It literally doesn't specify a region. All right. So, um... It is literally a taste of America. Indeed it is. Okay. And that's where we... <laughs> yeah. All right. What is the spice? Uh... Soy sauce? I'll give you a hint. It's red. Oh, tomato sauce. Well, kind of. <laughs> ketchup. <laughs> it's ketchup. Are you ready? Yeah. Here we go. Ooh, it's what I've been excited about for so long. See if it smells like ketchup. <laughs> That's pretty accurate. I mean, it's not as. It doesn't have as much of that, like, tang. Right? As ketchup does, but. Oh. Very. Very slight red. Yeah. Not too bad. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Give me a little sound. Anticipation, but I love this. <laughs> what do you think? Oh, I like them too. They're really like 
Yeah. They're unique. Yeah. But I feel like I've tasted that flavor before, just not, not in chips. Oh. Is it ketchup? I think it's ketchup. Yeah. <laughs> well, of no, course it's really it's ketchup. ketchup. It's tomatoey, it's kind of sweet. I eat those. The only thing, the only thing I would add to it if I was an executive at Lay's or something, right? Which I hope to never be, but you know. And I'm sorry, Lay's. By the way, we are not sponsored by Lay's. Not anymore. Nope. No. <laughs> okay. Uh, I would add a little tang to it. Mm. A little bit of a tang, because you know ketchup has like a, little a little bit of a tang. Vinegar, a little vinegary taste. Oh, a little vinegar, because yeah. ketchup is you know tomato and vinegar and all that. Yeah. Nice homemade ketchup. Alright, here is our very final tip ever that we're going to no, not not ever, but at least in this category. Yeah. Our fried pickles with ranch, which I frequently enjoy this dish. Well not frequently, I'd love to enjoy it more frequently. Anyway, I love fried pickles with <laughs> ranch is what I'm saying. Also, uh, you nail it on the bag color. <laughs> Alright. Inspired by deep red favorite at Midwestern State Fairs. Oh, yeah, State Fairs. We're going to go to State Fair next weekend. It's true. Yes. Get a taste of fried pickles with a ranch. Who's ready for a wine on the fair with me? Really? Yeah. Who's <laughs> <laughs> <All right. laughs> ready for a wine on the fair with huh? <laughs> <laughs> What is the seasoning? Dill pick a spice. Is it, no, I'm sorry, is it a fried pickle spice? Fried pickles with ranch seasoning. Okay. I love the seasoning so much. Mm. Ooh. 430 calories in here. What the? No fun? Okay. Alright. Expecting, oh, expecting pickle. Not getting pickle. Oh, I'm getting it. So, that's it. Just mm. get... No, 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 really. Just smell it for a second and process it. Doesn't it? Yeah, okay. It smells... Yeah? It smells exactly like it. To me? Uh, like... It's kind of got to... Got to get in there and the... It's <laughs> <that's> there. <laughs> How did he drown? In a bag of chips. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh, and by the way, I haven't mentioned, I love pickle-flavored chips. Right. Too, so I'm excited about this. Mm. All right. Are you ready for this? I love pickle flavor. I actually wasn't sure in the beginning. I no, because I was like, it's got this like, it doesn't have as much of a kind of sourness as yeah. normal pickle flavored chips. But then you're like, oh, there's that ranch. There's the, oh, I taste that. Yeah. You know? It's very, it's very good. Very dill. Good. I really like it. Okay. Yeah. Well, here's what I'm going to ask you. If you can remember all of the chips that we've tasted throughout this oh. entire thing, I'm going to ask you to pick your top two. <sighs> okay. All right. Um, this, you know. Yeah. What chips would you eat again? What do you think? And then silence be felt. I know. Well, <laughs> I'm, I'm considering. I'm considering them all that we had. I'm trying as, to remember. As am I. As am I. Um. um I remember that. Uh, I know. I know. I know the, one of them for me. The queso. <laughs> exactly. The queso. Chili Chili con queso. Chili con really queso good. was so good. Um, I know probably one of them is going to be that fried pickles ranch. I love it so much. Yeah. Um, yeah. So fried pickles. I, I love that queso so much. Yeah. Um, what else is really good? We decided the lobster and the crab not so good. Right. Those are probably um, the bottom two. Right. It was not very good. And you know. You know, I, I'm trying to remember all the chips we've tasted. Right, I am too. Yeah. There were a lot of them. There were a lot of them. Oh, the Thai sweet chili? Thai sweet good. chili was good. That was good. Yep. I, I'd eat that again. Right. I am going to go with uh, chili con queso and fried pickles with ranch. It's my two. Okay. 
I'm not rejecting at all the other ones because they're all pretty good. Um, what was the other? Uh, there was another spicy one or something. The uh, jalapeno poppers. Jalapeno poppers. Were oh good. yeah, I had, I like that one too. Yeah, yeah, that was a good one. So I probably go queso and, and jalapeno that's, poppers. That's what I. That's what I. Yeah. All right. So. But overall, most of them, yeah. most of them, overall, all, you know, these have been, this has been a very great little series. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah so we, we're about to be finished with season one here. Right. And is, no, no hints, but we are already planning season we two. We are, we have a, we have a large list of foods and things that we've found and in the process of purchasing or finding or whatever. Right. We're scouring the stores of food on the internet and all that. Can I give a little hint without giving anything away? Sure, sure. I think you know. I think next season, whenever that is, two weeks, a month, whatever. Right. Um, I don't know what you could say. We're going to uh, try some, maybe try some things that are a little more natural, a little mm-hmm. healthier, a little, a little healthier. more things that come from nature that are right. weird, very still unusual, very, very weird, um, and still extremely unusual, but. Again, things from different cultures and things from, you know, just things we've never tasted before that we think are interesting and right. you've probably never seen before. Right. You know, fruits so. and vegetables and such. Sure. And things. So. All right. No, it'll be fun. It will it'll be, be fun. fun. And, uh, yeah, we're looking at, you know, kicking off next season within the next couple of months, I say. You know, we'll find stuff, we'll, we'll get stuff, and we'll, we'll taste it. That's so. it. We'll, uh, we'll do a winter season. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. All right. Or Happy Hanukkah, or... Uh, All of them. Or, well, no. Ramadan's, Ramadan's like, I'm trying to think about the holidays. All of them. All of them. Happy all of them. Happy all of them. Yes. And, uh, we'll see you soon. Yes. Thanks for watching. <laughs> or just watch them again. Cause it'll be like we're still right. It'll be like it'll be like we're still here. You can start from the beginning and just right. keep on going in a loop. Right. This is all on a playlist too. So mm. if you haven't checked that out too, you can watch it from the beginning. And this one will be in there. That's probably where you're watching this. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I hope you enjoyed the kickoff to the series of Food Fellas. And we will see you next time, whenever that happens to be. Bye. Bye.